Happening at this hour, the former mayor of Allentown, Ed Polowski, is being sentenced for bribery, conspiracy, and fraud. He faces more than 15 years in prison. Eyewitness News reporter Shante Lyons is live outside the federal courthouse in Allentown. So, Shante, what has happened so far in the court today? Well, Jim, I can tell you that the former Allentown mayor showed very little emotion on the fourth floor courtroom. The defense has called 12 witnesses to the stand. They all spoke about his character. They called him a good person and says they helped, he helped improve the city. Overall, they want the judge to have leniency and to keep him out of prison until the appeal process is complete. Former Allentown Mayor Ed Pulowski faces sentencing for bribery, fraud, conspiracy, attempted extortion, and lying to the FBI. The 53-year-old Democrat was convicted back in March on charges that he traded city contracts for campaign cash. Prosecutors say Pulowski orchestrated a pay-to-play scheme by strong-arming city vendors to contribute to his failed campaigns for governor and U.S. Senate. The former mayor's political consultants cooperated with the government and recorded hundreds of conversations with him. Many of them, which were played for the jury during trial. Several city workers and vendors who pleaded guilty testified. A jury found Pulowski guilty on 47 of 54 counts. He denied any wrongdoing and has vowed to appeal his conviction. At the federal courthouse in Allentown, the defense has called more than a dozen witnesses to the stand. They all asked for leniency for Ed Pulowski. They want the judge to allow him to stay out of prison and with his family until his appeal is ruled on. Pulowski led Pennsylvania's third largest city for 12 years, winning re-election while under indictment. He started his fourth term in January, but resigned a week after his conviction. And the prosecution is expected to call their witnesses to the stand. Those are expected to be federal agents. Now both the defense and prosecuting attorneys are expected to speak outside the courthouse after the sentence hearing. And that's expected to be at some point this afternoon. Reporting live in downtown Allentown, outside the federal courthouse, Shante Lands, CBS 3 Eyewitness News. Thank you, Shante.